how did this came up? Ah, like, what's, yeah, what's the history? Or... I think it's, I, I don't know, but I imagine, yeah, <laughs> or I remember that I heard it was like a lake or something like that. That it was the, no, I don't know, I will search now. So, buenos dias everyone. We had a good night rest last night after <laughs> a very long day yesterday wherein we had to um, struggle with a lot of um, challenges because of the political strife and as well as the winds blowing from Lake Titicaca. My goodness. But anyway, unfortunately, we can't be able to like explore the whole of Copacabana today. We're heading towards Tikina, which is like a border area that separates um, Copacabana and uh, La Paz so we're gonna go come there because Martin our good friend from Bolivia is waiting for us we're gonna leave early because we don't want to be stuck on the road again because of the political strife that's happening here and as well as the weather hopefully the winds are not too strong from Lake Titicaca so that we can cross the, the lake from Tikina into Tikina Hopefully it's a good day today. <laughs> I have a good red nose. No. Mm. Ready for Tikina? Yes. Ready to meet Marlene? Yes. yes. Hopefully though. Ho hopefully we can. Hopefully we can cross. The, ready, we can ready, cross the lake. <laughs> ready not to use my suitcase. Anymore. <laughs> So guys, here's the surprise, the reunion, yeah! <laughs> after London, we met here in Tikina. After, <laughs> after, after, after almost, yeah, this one week, year? no, no, this, this week is going to be, yeah? no, two, two years, years two, two years. years, after two years, yeah, oh my god, actually, two years, actually this, this, week. this Sunday is two years, two years, this Sunday is two years. <laughs> two years. <laughs> <laughs> I miss him so much. <laughs> That's why you were asking, no one there. <laughs> 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 Finally, I met him. Yeah. Yeah. Seems so much. <laughs> Alright, we're riding now the ferry heading towards the other side of Tikina. Here we go. Alright, go. Yeah, and he went he went to he went to where? Um Vienna to sleep in the park. <laughs> That's why the people are brown, sure. but more in the town, like the cities. For example, if you if you go to La Paz, you will see that the people are... mountain ranges they change. Yeah, yeah. Wow, La Paz is down there. It's so small. And over there, the front is Peru. Mm -hmm. Ah, this one's Peru. Ah, okay. And other thing, for example, El Alto became a, a song, as a song. Yeah, I heard. I heard a song named El Alto. Because the people there and, and because all these people are mm -hmm. Andinian. Ah, they come from the Andes. Andes. Mm -hmm. And like 30, 40 years ago, the people were very, very racist. I hear. Very, very, very racist. Stop. Apel was here in Bolivia, so he built one of the stations here. Actually, it was for trains also. For trains? For, yeah. But now it's buses. For buses, yeah. Oh, yeah. Wow. yeah. Good to know. We really enjoyed oh, our journey oh, it's like in the past five years. It's five really years? Good. Yeah. So how many lines? 11 lines. Uh, I, I don't remember too much, but I think it's like 11, 11. lines. Wow. I don't so it's crazy, you know, because the cable cars here are like really like 
sort of like a transportation, then, like common transportation for the people of La Paz. Yeah, yeah, really yeah, nice no, structures of the house, like and even like I've never seen more. such lovely city set up. You know, the setup is really nice. You know, it's like hilly with the Andean mountains, surrounded by Andean mountains, with a mixture of like. Um, Modern, ancient, I don't know. I can't even put words how to describe La Paz. Guys, we're now here in La Paz and we're now gonna visit. Don't, don't take out your cup. Mamita! Oh. Hola, Mamita! <laughs> Matilda! Gopisima! Yeah, because it's a living holiday for her. Yeah. So, uh, the cable car, the vehicle. Okay. And uh, then. Uh, Wow, Mamita so good. Thank you, Mamita. Thank you. Thank you. I love you. <laughs> Mamita, very, very good. Oh my God. You know, never expected bueno. Mamita so good. Yeah, buddy. Yeah. What can you say about Mamita? Yeah. She's very beautiful. <laughs> very beautiful, I would agree. Really? Yeah. How do you say with Mamita? Good. Nice to meet her. She looks so young. Uh, yeah, very young. Yeah, yeah mom. Yeah, mom. I'm very happy that you are with me. Time to eat saltanias. Saltinas. Chicken. And meat? Meat. Okay. And the rest? Same? Same chicken meat? Okay. You trip? Only eat with one hand, without the spoon, and without. Uh, any drop. Okay. Very good. Uh -huh. Very good. Very good. So we're now eating saltanya. This is the traditional food of Bolivia. Really, really good. Down here in the past. It's like a panada in the Philippines, but it's really tasty. Um, you should try this one. Right now we're heading to Principal Square. Martin is gonna bring us to the heart of La Paz. So this is where the. the <coughs> No, President or Mayor is here, buddy? President, President. President of Bolivia is here? Yeah, yeah, he works here. Okay, he works here. <laughs> so okay, this is this is the principal, the mandatory. Oh, okay, so this is where he works, right? The, pres the presidential ward. The politicians are there. Yeah. Like senators. Ah, okay. <laughs> oh. Everybody, where are we now? Curly? We are Mirador of Kisamanya. Kisamanya. And look. Kisamanya You see the whole of La Paz. So we're heading towards, <laughs> towards an area where you can see the whole of La Paz. So this is called the Mirador de Akesamanya. If I pronounce it properly. But you know, you can see the whole view down here of the whole of La Paz. This is just our first few hours here in La Paz, but we've managed to like roam around from north, south, central, and down here in the uh, one of the viewing points down here in La Paz. So guys, we're now here in Valle de Luna. So this is the Moon Valley they call because it um, is very significant on the uh, landing of the moon by Neil Armstrong. He went here actually and he was so fascinated by the terrain and by the rock formations down here in Moon Valley. That's why it's called Moon Valley because you know it was like synonymous to the rock formations you can see from the craters of the moon and some of the observat observatories that were <laughs> <clears throat> used to like examine um, examine the moon they established it here like five years before near Amsung set foot set foot on the moon like five years after so it was like very significant very nice area as well and you know the rock formations are really amazing it was out of this world I've never seen such um, rock formations as before so it was like my first time how did this came up ah. like what was yeah, the history 
I think it's I, I don't know but I mentioned that yeah. <laughs> or I remember that I heard it was like a lake or something like that. That it was the no, I don't know. What the is the relationship between this one and Neil Armstrong? Because Neil Armstrong when he was in the capsule of Apollo in the space, he saw something brilliant in the space. Wow. And it was the salary of uni. And when he came to Bolivia, uh, he came here, and this was without without name. So when he visited this place, he says that it was really close as the as the moon, as mm -hmm. where he was. But was he able to see the moon first before seeing? Yeah, 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 yeah. because when moon he went to the moon, yeah, when he ah, went okay. to the moon, he saw something brilliant. And when he came to Bolivia, they bring to that place, and he saw that it was really similar as the moon here. And that's why it's called Moon, moon Valley. Valley. Ah. Yeah. Wow. Alright guys, so this is what makes La Paz very special because of the Teleferico or the cable car. So we're just gonna try riding the cable car and see the whole of La Paz during the night. So join us on our adventure for the night here in La Paz. So this is what makes La Paz very unique and very interesting because of the Teleperico, the cable car. Oh my god, look at that. So nice, we're done with Teleperico. It was so nice to see. La Paz during the night. So we'll try La Paz in the day, probably tomorrow. Definitely but, we'll do it again. Yeah, but this one, this is our last chance. <laughs> Bye. You sure? Sure. Uh, no, no, it's tracking first what to do because he might break all, you know? No, 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 just, 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 you know, like, like this. Good try, buddy. Ah, I have to drink it. Pear. Yeah, you know, pear. Pear. Peras. Uh, peras. 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 Pear. 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 Sorry. Pear, not pears. How's it? How's it? Ooh, it's fucking strong. Huh? Let's see. Bye. Uh, oh, you're pink. I really do. <laughs> it was a good time, too. <laughs> How did you see it? Going home. Bye. So happy we see it. The best view. Larga.